Hello and welcome to the new Power Query tutorial video. And in this tutorial video, I want to show you how you can apply the sorting features which is available in Power BI and specifically in Power Query under the Power BI. So sorting is very common feature as you know to sort the data in ascending or descending order. So before you bring the data inside the front end layer, which is this, where you can create charts and tables, you may want to sort the data so that you are getting the data as per your need. If that's what the requirement is, then I'll show you how you can do that using two different features that we have in Power Query. Before that, just a quick information that if you have landed very first time on my channel, then you should know about this uh, Power uh, Power BI video tutorial sheets, which I keep it in the description. The idea behind this is that you are able to search any of my previously uploaded videos uh, because the title is present in the column A and the link is present in column B. That way you can easily jump onto that video like all of these folks are using it. So that way searching any of my Power BI, BI video becomes super easy. And the data set is present over here. Uh, which is Power BI Sample Superstore dataset, which I'll be using in this tutorial. Okay, so first thing first, to open the um, the to open the Power Query, we need to click on under the Transform Data. Let's go into the Transform Data option that will open up the Power Query window for us. And in the Power Query window, then we can use the uh, data source. Either we can bring it from here by clicking on Axel. Or we can come over here and I can basically select the recently used one. Okay, so it this will appear a new window and you can select on the sheet one. This will enable the preview and you can click OK. And once you click OK, the query or the sheet one will appear over here. This is the name of the tab or the sheet over there. These are the steps which we can apply and here it will start recording if we have applied sorting or any other data massaging feature on to this data. Okay, so topic of this video is sorting, right? Let's say uh, one of the scenario is we have a customer name. Maybe we want to sort it by customer name from A to Z, right? Just just as a, a you know scenario if we have in the hand. So one of the ways we can easily do that is option over here where we have the sort ascending order, right? Or if it is descending that we want, you know, we can get it onto the descending order. The best way, the what you get about this feature is that, for example, if you are looking for a particular customer, for example, if I do sort A to Z because that name was a little difficult for me to pronounce. So the way arrow on is over here, you know, that basically shows these, these are all the orders or these are all the lines which is related to the iron. You can basically see, okay, in standard class, first class, what is the, uh, how the ship mode is there. When was the order placed by Aaron, right? And uh, where it is, uh, from which city looks like, if it is the same Aaron, then looks like this person is changing the state and the cities, right? And then uh, all that information. So it becomes really easy. Let's say if you are looking for a specific customer, the whole life cycle of it, it becomes quite easy to understand about it, right? So one of the ways is to do the A to Z or Z to A over there. Also, you have the option over here where uh, in this drop down, let's say you don't want to go over there or this is hidden for some reasons. Then you can even come over here, click on sort A to Z or same thing, uh, ascending or descending. And then you also have the option of clearing the sort, which you don't have it over here, but you can clear the sort over there. This will be the default or how you imported the data is basically the same order. So that means no sorting at all. So this is what you can basically do to uh, to apply the sorting onto this uh, data set. And generally you may want is another thing you may want is you may want to uh, sort the data, let's say by sales, by quantity, you know, just to check the highest quantity, who is really ordering the highest quantity. The highest quantity is 14 right um, and that's what it is from the highest perspective highest quantity perspective same way highest profit higher sales we can import it and that way let's say that's the data structure if you want to use it into your data you know you have it ready for your report layout so that's what i wanted to show you and uh, once you are done you click on close and apply and that basically loads the data into the front end so that's mainly i wanted to show you how you can apply this sorting 
within the power query and uh, then get the data inside the uh, inside the sheet okay with that thank you so much i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic